To turn on the light, simply push the power on button, which turns on all the fixtures at neutral white. When pushing the intensity button, you can then change the intensity by dialing the wheel. Selecting colors is done by using the color button, giving a simple way to select any color. And then, if desired, the saturation of the color can easily be changed by pushing the saturation button to make colors more or less saturated. What? If none of the three control buttons has been selected, you can change the color temperature simply by dialing the wheel. On the bottom of the controller, you will find four preset buttons, which have been pre-programmed with dynamic movements. If you'd like to change the color of a dynamic movement, simply select the preset, and then select color button, and you can now change the color by dialing the wheel. The saturation of a dynamic movement can also be changed simply by selecting the saturation button. If none of the three control buttons has been selected, the speed can also be changed either to make the movement slower or faster. If you want to save your changes to the preset, simply hold down the preset button for two seconds and the preset is now updated with the changes you've made. If you wish to save a static color to a preset, simply deselect presets, then select your color, and hold down the desired preset button, and your static color is now saved. If you've changed or overwritten a preset and wish to go back to the original state of the preset, simply hold down the preset button for four seconds, and all changes made to that preset are now deleted. If you hear this sound, when trying to save a preset, it means that the button has been locked by the installer and changes cannot be saved.